They ran the MRI and they came back in the room and told me I had a brain tumor. And I was in shock for like the whole next day. I flipped out. I was like, brain tumor, that's it. What can they do about that? You know, that's, you're a goner. I think I'll always remember Nestlein's case. It's, it's sort of everyone's uh, worst nightmare in many ways. It's a beautiful young woman, prime of her life, of her career, has a headache. And everyone was telling her, well, it's just a headache. And in fact, something, something sinister was, was lurking on the scan. And on closer review of her imaging studies, it, it appeared that she had a malignant brain tumor. The scariest moment was knowing that I had to have brain surgery. I think until you face something like this, the thought of brain surgery is very daunting. It was absolutely devastating to me. And one of the things that I definitely appreciate about Henry Ford is the whole team here is so hopeful and they're so positive. Fortunately, at Henry Ford, we have the technology, the interoperative MRI scanning, plus all of our functional imaging, where we were able to offer a technique to go in and in real time see where the tumor was located and protect the normal brain. We did just that, and I'm thrilled to report that she's had a great outcome. I feel very fortunate that I'm able to go ahead now, two and a half years after having brain surgery, and I'm doing great living my life, and I feel confident that should I need further treatment, that I'm in the right place to get it. As difficult as these tumors are to treat, we've never lived through a time that's more exciting and filled with promise. Many of these treatments that we're offering today weren't even available two years ago, five years ago, and so every month that goes by is a time when new clinical trials are bringing new promise, new treatments, and uh, we're excited to be able to offer all of them here at Henry Ford. My name is Nestle Gay. I'm from Southfield, Michigan, and I'm a survivor. <laughs>